friends in today's episode we would be discussing about a dynamic super powerful tool to connect you with your own self this tool would be a mirror where you can clearly see yourself from within and the tool is journaling yes you got me right the tool is journaling and this is neelam sethia coming up with the benefits of journaling what is journaling journaling is a written record of your thoughts emotions and feelings there aren't any set rules for journaling but it is imperative to do it as a daily exercise it is a way to track your everyday life by your own self it is a way to track and figure it out that what makes you happy and what makes you upset creating meaningful connections with yourself is as important as creating meaningful connections with your friends or with your family or rather i would say it is much more important to have meaningful connection with yourself than having it with your friends or with your family so journaling involves the practice of keeping a daily diary or a journal or maybe at times loose sheet of paper which you can destroy it afterwards that explores thoughts and feelings surrounding the events of your life it is simply writing down your thoughts emotions to understand them more clearly more prominently if you are struggling with stress anxiety or depression then keeping a journal would help you in shifting your emotion it can help you gain control of your emotions and improve your mental health the most important fact to know in journaling is that you need to pen down write down your feelings on a white bright paper in all school way or rather all student way writing means writing and not typing it on mobile laptop or any other gadget i know that writing and typing complement each other but here you need to write because there is a hand to brain coordination there is a connectivity between your hand and brain which we call it as neural pathway which connects directly connects with your emotions so whatever your mind instructs your hand starts writing it starts moving in that direction here there is no diversion through any keypad or any electronic gadget when you are writing you are pouring your heart out onto that paper you are pouring your brain out onto that paper research shows that brain process 4 gb data per minute yes 4 gb data per minute and when we translate it into thoughts that would be equal to 50 thoughts per minute so some of the thoughts can go unnoticed but a few prickly thoughts or maybe a few soothing thoughts has to get noticed for a better nicer smoother comfortable lifestyle hence writing physically allows the neural pathway to transit good or bad from your brain from your heart to the paper after writing down the daily happenings your feelings your emotions you can become a spectator of your very own feelings the feelings which were inside you now they are right in front of you and it is up to you whether you say hooray or ha after reading your feelings and your emotions now let us quickly go through the benefits of journaling journaling helps you to connect your values emotions and goals it helps you in mental clarity to focus that what exactly you want from life it acts as a personal therapist or a personal coach which helps you in overcoming your ego anger anxiety frustration disappointment or depression etc etc it tracks your overall development and it helps you in setting your goal and then it helps you in achieving it then journaling helps you in organizing your thoughts and make them apprehensible journaling acts as a window through which you can vent out your emotions and your feelings and you can set yourself a free bird 
Journaling allows you to relieve your stress. It helps you in boosting your memory power and increases creativity in you. It helps you in expressing your gratitude. So to sum up, it helps you in being a better version of you. So keep journaling, keep expressing yourself to you, keep unfolding yourself till the next episode of Happy by Choice. Bye-bye.